Hey guys, it's me, Kanam, and I'm back with Lunar Silver Star Story Complete. We are in the weird woods and trying to get out. Not that way, apparently. What? It's locked, Alex. I wonder what's inside. I didn't know that was a chest there. I just kind of peeked at it, but okay, we'll have to remember that, I guess. Oh! Err. <laughs> What? What are you? Stay back! Get away from us! No, oh, we're surrounded. There, there's too many of them, Alex! Let's run for it! We can take these guys, come on! Oh, 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 okay, now there's a lot of them. We can still take them, come on. We're surrounded! Alex, I'm too young and promising to die! Oh ho ho! Looks like we have a bit of trouble here! He looks like Scottish with the beret and everything. I can't do a Scottish accent, but I'll try. Who are you? Where did you come from? What the heck is going on? Hmm. Perhaps this isn't the best time for an introduction. That's horrible Scottish. Do you kids want some help, or can you handle these critters by themselves? Yourselves. Help us! Oh, ho, ho. let's have a crack at these things then. These thugs then. Suppers are coming and I need to work up an appetite. I can't do Scottish apparently. Suppers are coming and I need to work up an appetite. There we go. Got it. Is he going to fight with us? Cool. Liake. It looks like lake with an I in the middle. Liake? Liake? Whatever. Thanks, bro. Alright, let's kill some things. See, this is why you save your attacks, Alex. Jeez. it's a lot of fucking goblins. Okay, um... Does anybody need healed? Can you hypnotize? Yeah, try it out. Oh yeah, Ramus is useless. What about you? You have no magic? Seriously? Okay, we'll kill a thing. Nice! Alright! Oh wow, okay. Keep going, like eh? Loyake! The Scotsman! Did that work on anybody? Hey, hey, it worked on some. Nicely done, Alex. And you still got beaten up for it. Very well done, Ramus. This isn't bad, we got this. We could've taken this without him, but hey, glad to have you. All right, um, kill that thing. Hypnotize, so it makes them pass their turn for a round. That's what that looks like. Recover condition? Yeah, we'll do that to Alex, because he's poisoned. Um, and the other one is still a sheep, so we're in, a sheep, ha. Huh? It sounds like a sleep, ha ha ha. Oh wow, all three of them. Thanks, Lyke, hey, you're Scotman. Let's see if I can keep the accent consistent. My bet is not high. Remus gained a level. Nalls flying around in celebration. Okay, we got it. He gained a level. <laughs> look at look at them all dancing. It's so cute. The sculptman is like, yeah, 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 yeah. Pat my stomach. <laughs> they ran away. We killed them. We did it. Who are you, Mister? I should ask. What are you? What a hapless bunch you are! You're lucky I happened to come along when I did! Didn't you know that these woods were ridiculously dangerous for ordinary travelers? Are you lost? Or out for a picnic? What? An adventure? What? <laughs> That's pretty spot on with that accent. Hey, nice. Scottish. What's so funny? The four of you are on an adventure. That's the best line I've heard in some time. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'll rip up a nice fire and some grub and you can tell me all about it. Now he sounds Irish. Damn it all. Damn it all. Don't worry kids, the smoke from the herbs I'm burning will keep the monsters away. You're smarter than you look, mister. I'm impressed. Oh, 
Thank you, I think. But I'm not smart. When you travel as much as I do, you just learn things along the way. Come on, kids, it's chilly. Let's get closer to the fire. <laughs> I just realized I haven't even asked you your names yet. You can call me Lyke. I'm Alex. And this is my friend Ramus. Hello. I'm No. And I'm Luna. We're traveling from the village of Berg. Thank you for helping us defeat the monsters, Lyke. You're quite kind. Hmm, Luna. Is something wrong, Lyke? Are you creeping on her? Oh, nothing. That's just a name I've not heard in a long time. Your village is the birthplace of Dragon Master Dine, right? Yes, Dragon Master Dine is our hero. Well, he's my hero. I've dreamt of growing up to be just like him. So, you're gonna be a Dragon Master, huh? I, I, I'd like to. Aunt Luna fell asleep. No, mat no dream is out of reach, Alex, no matter how impossible it might seem. And in order to accomplish your dreams, you need plenty of food and rest. So you're saying I can accomplish anything? <laughs> Indeed you can, Noel. All right, Alex, let's finish our food and get some sleep. We have to get up early while the monsters are still groggy. I am so sorry you have to put up with my accent or attempt at it. He has the green eyes. I wonder if... The green eyes, what was I telling you? I said about the green eyes, man. I hope he's gone. What the? Mike, he's gone. That was kind of rude of him to leave without saying goodbye. But anyone who laughs at my jokes is a good man. I hope we meet him again. He was a great swordsman. Much better than you, Alex. I think you've been sloughing off in your practice again. She has a point, Alex. We can't count on people to bail us out of trouble. Like I said, we're close to the exit, right? After we get out of here, we head south. To the port of Saith, where we set sail from Merbia and take our first step into the shining path of glory. Deep breaths, Ramus. <laughs> yeah, Ramus, deep breaths. Useless sod. I mean, I guess he did attack decently well. What do we have? We have a treasure chest. And I want to dodge that, but that passage is so narrow. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Come up here where I can dodge you. Yeah, come over here. Yeah, okay, okay. No, that was that was that was poorly done. Damn it. Fuck you Oh shit, you serious? I can't get out. Well that was dumb of me. Okay, um Alex gained a level though. Damn it. Eventually I'll remember not to hit that button. One of these days. One of these days. Uh Alex gained a level and he also learned explosion staff. Um, yeah, about, I'm, I'm not going to comment on the name of that. You guys can just go ahead and think for yourselves what that sounds like. This is supposed to be a child-friendly game, people. Okay, um, yeah. So he gained a level and that happened. And I would heal, but like, see, this is why I don't like that they give everything to Alex. Stop that. Stop. He doesn't need everything. You hold on to shit and all. You've got the room. You've got the wings. Run, run, no, go. Yes, made it. Is this the, yes, that's the exit. Now we're going south to the village and there's no overworld monster so we can explore. Look at how pretty it is. I like the little pixelated overworld style. That sounds not good. I don't think we need we don't need to be here yet, but I don't know what got me, but uh, we haven't seen these before, so mutant ants. I don't quite know that I'm supposed to be here, but might as well uh you know Might as well try out our new song, right? Yeah, you hit somebody in the back. And you in the front. Alright, let's see what we got. Yeah! That wasn't so great. I mean, it did fine enough. It killed him. Bastards. Alex, you gonna let him do that? Easy. One E. Enemy zone, I think? Yeah, that, that kills two enemies if it's near two. So, go for that. And that. And... 
Now see that is nifty. That's useful. Put you. Fuck you it. Assholes, all of them. Yeah, so maybe we weren't supposed to be here yet, but here we are. Sweet, we killed him anyway. Doesn't matter. Fuck you, ants. 70 silver, nice. And then we gained a level. Tranquil song learned. I like the sound of that. Oh, there was a little bug. Are you serious right now? I didn't even save? Fuck you, yeah, fuck you. I got out of there. That was some expert dodging skills, man. That was some skills. I got skills. Alright, we're going into this town. Because they probably have an inn where I can rest. Saith, right? That's the town's name. Do, 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 do. Lovely background music. Listen to that. Listen to how nice that is. Do, 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 do. Welcome to the port of Saith. Did you journey from Berg? Oh, I see. The fog is lifted from the woods. I'm so relieved to hear that. You're welcome to rest here as long as you'd like. Do you smell that? The whole town reeks of fish! I'm in heaven! <laughs> and Nala's is our little guardian angel. <laughs> adorable. Adorable. Okay, is there like a weapons armor shop? There has to be. There always is. What are you? You're nothing. That looks like an inn, maybe. That's a pub, clearly. Oh, the Athena statue, of course. That's where we go. Um, no armor? Really? No? None? I mean, I would think they'd have a weapon shop, but apparently not. Apparently I'm wrong. You guys traveling from Berg? That's impossible. The forest has been blanketed with thick fog for days. No one can travel through it. The fog is gone thanks to Luna's song. She has a great pair of lungs. That's an odd compliment, but okay. Great! Now I can attend the Goddess Festival in Berg. Oh, so people do usually travel through there. It's not always, like foggy hell. Alright, so do you have anything I can take from your home? Do you? You know, a treasure chest lying around that you're just not using? No? Okay. Well, geez. Um... Mm -mm. Is this the weapon shop? It looks like some sort of shop. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the weapon shop of Saith. What can I do for you? You can give me weaponry. I don't want anything for you yet. Okay, <laughs> length does matter. <laughs> you know what I mean? No. Kinky? Kinky? Yet comfy. Who designed- I never noticed these things when I was like, you know, eight and playing this for the first time. I- I was innocent once. I was a sweet summer child. And now I see things like kinky yet comfy and I'm like, leather clothes. Hmm. I see you game designers. I see you developers. I see you and I approve. The leather armor though uh, increases his defense more. So we're gonna go with leather armor. We're gonna equip the sword and the armor. And Luna, you get a bow. Look at you. For archers on a budget. Oh, you can't equip that. So you're gonna have the kinky leather clothes, Luna. Enjoy that. I'm sure Alex will. And Ramus. Oh, he could be an archer, but I mean, he does well enough with the sword. Oh, well, he can't have the sword, so you're sticking with what you got. You can be kinky yet comfy or reinforced. We're gonna reinforce ya. There you go. And now we're going to sell the stuff that we don't need any longer. When I was younger, I was really bad about, like, being very nostalgic about the beginning equipment so I would keep it throughout the game um, and actually that turned out to be a bit of a good thing because in later games um, pleasure doing business with you please come again in later games they developed the mechanic for upgrading equipment which wasn't so much of a thing you know back in this day but um, I did intend to hit save that time but um, when it became it I already had the habit of like keeping all my equipment so, but now I sell it because I know that I don't need it later for this particular game. The most of the stuff, anyway. What's in here? This is a pub. How are... Hey, what are kids doing in here? My first customer's hour. They're underaged. I need something to bring in new patrons. Anything. Well, too bad for you. We need a boat. We need a boat. 
And this is the dock, so I'm going to assume this is where we get a boat. You look like a captain. You look like a pirate, but you look like a captain. Ahoy, mateys! I'm the captain of the Hispaniola, bound for Moribia. The sea is tossing so hard that I need my sea chart to navigate it, but I seem to have gambled it away. Her, that scurvy dog. He won't be so lucky next time. I'll have a rematch or his head, I tell ye. What's the sea chart? Some kind of really yummy fish? No, silly. It's a map of the ocean. Sailors use it to avoid hazards. And he gambled it away. Well, we were just in the pub, so I bet somebody in the pub is who he gambled it to. Let's see here. Let's see here. It's always a shady guy in the back. Howdy, children. My name's Brett. I reckon I'm the best there is when it comes to gambling. I don't care if I'm playing a man, woman, or child. As long as they have money, I'll take it. Yep, you're the one. Well, are you gonna... Nope. Okay. Okay. I <laughs> lost uh, my money. I uh, earned on my <laughs> voyage. Wow. Wow. You're just a mess of human bodily functions, aren't you? Wow. Okay. Uh, maybe the guy at the front desk of the... in here. No, let me... move. Jeez. That sailor had me pinned up against the wall for a second. The captain was fooled into losing his sea chart in a car name with the infamous gambler named Brett. The captain is a fine sailor, but he's the worst poker player in history. The man's eyes twinkle with delight every time he gets two cars with pretty pictures on them. Now I have a port full of angry passengers, drunken sailors, and rotten cargo. Lovely. Brett, he's gloating at the bar. Yeah, we know. We just... Now can I go talk to Brett? Probably. Stupid Brett. Stupid Brett. Brett the Brat. Pardon? You want the sea chart? Hmm. Jam with me and I reckon we can talk. How about it? I reckon we will. Okay. Alright then, let's play for a hundred silver. Start with a real easy game, son. I toss a coin, you guess heads or tails. Call it. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Say stop. Say stop. Say! Tails. So sorry, son. It's heads, not tails. Shame, ain't it? But I reckon that's why they call it gambling. <laughs> Ramus is angry. Oh, we lost our hundred silver. Just one more game, son. I don't want to leave you broke. Heads or tails? Uh, what do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Go. Dag nab your luck, son. It's tails. I win again. Now he's a hillbilly. He went from pirate to hillbilly. Hmm. Hey, Alex. Did you look at the coin he's using? I mean, really look. What do you mean, Remus? The coin he flips isn't the same as the coin he so shows us. But it's switching after the toss. What? Are you sure we should accuse the best gambler in this town of cheating? Come on, Nall. If anyone knows anything about money, it's me. Let's do it one more time. It'll be fun, I promise. Okay. Your kids are back? Come on, now. I don't want to win no more of your allowances. Just ain't right. We want to make things interesting, Brett. We want to bet this. What, Remus? Remus, you better be sure about what you're doing. We didn't come all the way from Seth to lose the diamond on a coin flip. Holy goddess, Althena, I reckon that's the prettiest rock i ever seen. You got yourself a bet, son. Ha! There, see? So Remus's plan was to beat up Brett? Sheer genius. Put that coin down, boy. Why, Brett? So I don't notice it has two heads? <gasps> Brett, you're nothing but a lying, cheating weasel. I knew the coin was fake when I heard it hit the table. A real coin makes a deeper clink. Oh dear, I've been caught by a child. If news of this were to travel, I'd be ruined, you naughty, beastly boy. I'm the, he's the naughty, beastly one? We got our 200 silver back. I see your fraudulent accent was as fraudulent as your coins. Oopsie. <laughs> don't you know that you can't con a con? Game over, Brett. Give us the sea chart. I'm afraid I don't have it. Please don't shove me again. I bruise quite easily and I'm a bleeder. What? You said we had to gamble for it. I said you had to gamble, but I never said I had the chart. You, you ninny ninny dum dum puppy head. <laughs> we have the kinky leather in the shop, but the, the worst insult is ninny ninny dum dum poopy head. 
Um, well said, Nal. I traded the sea charm to an old woman in the forest northwest of Saith. She gave me this. Fortune cane. Take it with you. Perhaps the woman will trade again for this cane or for something else. Okay, so that's the forest we were just at, but now we have new equipment. So I guess that's where we're going, but we will have to go in the next episode, because we're all out of time for this one. Um, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave me a like or a comment below. Um, as always, please no spoilers for anybody who hasn't seen this game, even though it's like way old by now, but still, um, no spoilers for anybody. But tips and tricks, always welcome. And uh, we will head into this forest. We will see if we can't find the old woman and trade her her cane back for um, the sea chart and get going from Saith to Meridia. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!